Hey guys, Fire here, bringing you another game review. This time we're checking out Unimime Unicycle Madness. This game is developed and published by Rafflecopter Inc. and releases on June 22nd, 2023 for a price of $5. So what is this Unicycle Madness style game? Um, it's... Pretty simplistically, it's a game where you're going to be balancing on a unicycle, as you can see here, trying to get from point to point to complete out objectives. The game's fairly simplistic and pretty basic, and as you can see, it does support online leaderboards between you and your friends, so you can see how kind of you rank between everybody. Now, there's going to be coins and different things you can collect and try to accomplish when you're going between levels, as well as there's also challenges for you to keep your hat on, get levels done in a certain amount of time, and a couple cosmetic things that you can unlock while you are playing in the, the game. Now, as far as the cosmetic stuff, it's nothing that impacts the game, but it's more just neat little cute characters that you can kind of upgrade your stuff or your character to look like. Personally, I like Cyclosaurus, so Cyclosaurus is going to be kind of the character I play with. Now, you're going to be playing over 80 plus levels, and every level is going to have a unique set of challenges and obstacles that you need to complete and face, whether it's getting from one point to the other end, dodging things in time, or hitting ramps, or having to dip, dodge, duck, dive, and squeeze between every little thing in the game, you're going to have opportunities to really push yourself and try to not only get all the coins in a level, but even try to attempt to uh, get everything done in a fast amount of time. You're going to have a lot of times in this game, though, where you are going to get frustrated, you're going to fail more than you're going to succeed, and to be honest, that's honestly a fun little portion of the game. You know, can you push your the boundaries and limits to get all the coins? Can you get every level done without losing your little hat here? Or are you destined to just continue to fall through the crack um, and just, you know, f have misery as you fail over and over trying to complete out the courses? Now, what's cool with the game is it doesn't just have you doing things on kind of one direction and in, in, in a sense is you're sometimes going to be having to go leaning to the left or leaning to the right to complete out those objects and the game also does a really good job it introduces new ob uh, introducing new objects and mechanics within the game itself now let's talk real briefly about controls you're going to be using your analog stick here to kind of lean and then your triggers are going to be kind of your directional acceleration now you have to kind of count balance all of that with the leans that you're doing and while you're doing all of that you have to make sure you don't fall over or in the case with your hat you don't lose your hat because that's part of the challenges with the game is you're trying to get from point to point and not have yourself fail but also trying to see what can you do to complete set objectives that you need to accomplish while you're going through. Now, a lot of these levels are only going to take you a handful of attempts to really get through them after failing the first go. But if you really want to sit and grind at everything, you're going to have to spend a lot of time learning how things work. It's got a real trials skill level vibe in the sense of the levels get increasingly more and more difficult as you go, and the mastery that you need to be able to control things, to be able to hit those coins, land and survive with your hat, are all really demanding and something that the game does a really good job at not giving you a game that's just another easy game to notch out into your belt, but a game that's going to really challenge you to have to push and pull yourself to get to those finishing points as well as trying to just complete out everything like i said there's well over 80 plus levels and you can track all your stars and progressions while you're playing to be able to then go back and try to complete out those challenges as you can see there's 360 stars to earn so it's going to take you a long time to really get and knock out everything within the game but with a lot of effort and practice, you should be able to complete Unimi Unicycle Madness in no time. Now, as far as an opinion, like, do I recommend this game? I think it's a f fun game for $5, and, you know, if you're a Trials fan, it's, you know, 
kind of that ish niche of a game. You know, it's not anything bad. I like the music style and I like the difficulty. You know, it's a game that does a good job at ramping itself up, but it's also a game that's not trying to do more than what it is. It just wants to be a challenging little kind of puzzle game here. You have to just literally keep going and getting one little step further than what you did before. And, you know, it's. It's rewarding when you finally beat that level that you're stuck on, or maybe you can't quite figure out how to get through an obstacle, or even better, maybe you want to try to best your friends on the leaderboard. All of that's available in this very simplistic game that's only five bucks, and you know, it checks a lot of boxes. It's very rewarding, and as you can see here, we got so close, but it's just that sense of, I'm almost there, one more shot. Oh, wait, and it then adds in the mechanic of, Okay, I did it, but my friends did it faster. Can I climb up? I think there's going to be a lot of people in like the speedrunning s community that really find and enjoy this game and have a good time with it. You know, it's something that it is enjoyable, it's frustrating, but it's all there in the same go, and you can definitely have a lot of fun with this game. So yeah, that's my thoughts on Unimeme Uni Unicycle Madness. Let me know what you think down below in the comments. I hope you enjoyed this review and maybe consider hitting that subscribe button. We'll catch you next time. Have a great rest of your day.